Man, they always trying to lie. They think we slow. They think we slow. Y'all, we ain't slow. We know what's going on, Marjorie. We know what's going on, Steve Harvey. Y'all can try to come to any platform y'all want to. And hear Marjorie talking about her platform. Bitch, you ain't got no dang on platform. Y'all just keep it all the way 100, man. Man, let's break down this whole story, man. Well, Marjorie Harvey trying to finesse all of us into thinking she wasn't giving up them old ass goodies to the bodyguard, y'all. Let's get into this story. You're now tuned in to YouTube's favorite, Lionel B. The Lion B Show. What's up, peeps? Welcome back to the Lionel B Show. It's your first time tuning into the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the videos, man. Also, make sure y'all click that notification bell button so anytime I drop a brand new video, y'all be the first ones to get it. Now, peeps, it looks like Marjorie Harvey is finally addressing the cheating rumors. Now, y'all know for about the past three days, man, there's been rumors going around the internet that she's been cheating with Steve Harvey's bodyguard. Now, most of the time, man, Marjorie Harvey does not address any type of cheating rumors or anything about their relationship. But it looks like, guys, something hit a nerve. Your ass just got busted. Now, generally, when people try to come out and clear their name, there's definitely something going on behind it. And social media is not going for her statement. Now, guys, she actually took to Instagram and made a post trying to clear up her name. And guess what? She wanted to bring God in it. Sure. In a post, she said, this is the website, mattmcmillanministries.com, how to handle being lied about. She says, my husband and I don't usually stop to address all the foolishness and lies that have been spread about us. However, to whom much is given, much is required. I understand that with my platform comes some sort of responsibility to those that may not be as strong as we are. Read and share this with your loved ones that may not know how to properly cope. God bless you. Now, in this verse, guys, it is 1 Peter 2.23. It says, when they heard their insults at him, he did retaliate. When he suffered, he made no threats. Instead, he entrusted himself to him who judges justly. Now, man, lady, first of all, stop the damn cap. We already know when OGs get caught up in trouble, the first thing they want to do is go on to Facebook and post a damn Bible verse. Instead of just saying, I ain't do it, being real, saying you ain't cheap. Lady, you damn did it. Now, we ain't slow. You know, the first thing they want to do is pull out that Bible verse and talk about, oh, you know, they just usually we don't get into this foolishness. I already sat, sat down with your husband, Jim Townsend, and he already told the truth about you, man. You a lady of the night and your daughter, Lori Harvey, is on that same type of thing as well. You might as well come clean, man. We already know there's phone calls, there's information out there, there's leaks out there. And guys, this is what's going to happen. All right. Now, a lot of people out there saying, oh, we don't want to see, you know, power couple go up. This BS, man, because it was a BS relationship to begin with. You know what I'm saying? She was already messing with some kingpins back in the day. She didn't magically change overnight. And also she gave Lori Harvey, you know what I'm saying, Steve Harvey's name. And that's not even his real daughter. OK, the lady, she's a lady of the night, man. She's a damn thought. T-H-O-T. -T. OK, whatever. The lady is capping. And also, guys, if you watched my previous video, I did on Steve Harvey and Marjorie Harvey. And also with the ex-husband, he was actually still talking to Marjorie two days up until they got married, y'all. Not engaged, married. And then she decided to change her phone number after she got all that thotting out of the way. Then all of a sudden, she want to cut my man Jim off. You know what I'm saying? But lady, you was courting this man all the way up to the point where you actually married Steve Harvey. So let's keep it all the way 100. And that's why Lori Harvey be going through men the way that she do. Okay? The apple does not fall far from the tree. 
Now, it's definitely interesting, man, that Marjorie Harvey came out and actually said something about these rumors. Because like she said, usually she don't have nothing to say. But all of a sudden, you feel triggered, you feel pressured, and you want to clear your name. So, y'all, don't believe the cap, man. We already know Marjorie Harvey been giving out them old school snacks to that damn bodyguard. She probably been doing this shit for a long time. And even Steve Harvey came out and dressed it. Check out what Steve Harvey had to say. <laughs> As they feeling that pressure right now, they already know what's going on. And I'm gonna tell y'all guys, this is what's gonna happen. All right, they're gonna keep denying it, denying it, denying it. Within about a few months, maybe a few weeks, all of a sudden, there's gonna be a divorce that goes down. Okay, you know what I'm saying? She's wanting somebody younger. She's wanting somebody probably in better shape. She was cool with Steve Harvey because he had the money, just like she was cool with all the other dudes she had back in the day. And once she get bored of that money, she move on to something else. She'll probably move over to the next bag. And at her point right now, man, she'll probably get a good settlement in that divorce. So right now, she probably want her a little young thing. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, she already thinks she's young like Lori. So, guys, this is definitely crazy, man. Marjorie Harvey and Steve Harvey, man, they got the weirdest relationship in the world. They reminded me of an older Will and Jada where the woman kind of wears the pants. And it kind of seems like that's what Marjorie Harvey does. Because I don't really honestly think Steve Harvey can do any damn better. Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't feel like Steve Harvey can do any better. He's already getting up there in age. You know what I'm saying? This thing probably ain't even working no more. You know what I'm saying? He probably popping them blue pills like damn M&Ms at this point. But man, for her to come out and try to clear it and for Steve Harvey to come out and try to clear it, you already know, man, something is definitely going on in this particular relationship. Mark my words, man. Y'all stay tuned on this here. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this, man. Keep your ear to the streets. If y'all have any info going on, man, make sure y'all DM me on Instagram at official line B. And I'm going to peep y'all on the next one. Holla. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to Beardison, the ultimate beard care revolution for the modern man. Now, in a world where grooming matters, Beardison stands tall, raising the bar for exceptional beard care. Their secret, a fusion of nature's finest ingredients meticulously crafted to unleash the true potential of your facial hair. No more settling for average, embrace the best. With Beardison, witness your beard transform into a symbol of unrivaled masculinity and confidence. And the best part, you can have Beardison delivered straight to your door thanks to a partnership with Amazon.com. Now don't wait any longer. Elevate your beard game with Beardison because greatness lies within every strand. Click the link in my description right after this video. Unlock the power of your beard. Available now on Amazon.com. Seize the opportunity and let your beard make a statement today.